The prickly pear is a member of the cactus family and every year produces a fruit known as the prickly pear fruit or Indian fig. The plants can develop into a tangled structure with spines or hair-like prickles emanating from green, smooth, flattened shoots. The fruit is fairly sweet to taste and is usually used to make jam or eaten whole. However, the skin must be removed before eating them and care must be taken with the spines. Prickly pears were exported to Malta from southern Italy in the early 1900s and to this day the juice is used to make a delicious but potent liqueur. The juice and pulp are known to be soothing to the skin and centuries ago were used in the treatment of open wounds. The cactus is found in abundance in Mexico and throughout South America as well as southern Europe and is used in the farming of the dye cochineal which is a red food colorant. The scale insect lives on the prickly pear and an acid is extracted from the body and eggs of the insect which is red in color and used to make the dye. Yes, insects have been added to our food for quite some time. The dye was used many years before by the Aztecs in Mexico for colouring cloth. Prickly pears are full of goodness and packed full of nutrients such as vitamin C, vitamin E, magnesium and potassium and they're good for promoting strong teeth and bones, helping to combat osteoporosis and helping to prevent heart attacks and strokes. They connect to the root, sacral and heart chakras and promote blood cell growth and weight loss as well as assisting to lower cholesterol levels helping to fight diabetes. They're anti-inflammatory and have been known to help with prostate problems, gastrointestinal issues, IBS, colitis and diarrhea. They're also believed to prevent cancer and give our immune systems a boost. In southern Italy and southern Spain, they're used as boundaries or hedgerows for dividing land where there is a lack of dry stone walls. But before the days of indoor plumbing, they were used as the latrine area, since the roots of the cactus are known to absorb moisture at a rapid rate, as well as provide privacy from passers-by, proving that perhaps they're not so prickly after all. <laughs>